So all my life, I've never was interested in the whole concept of religion. It's not that I hated it, it's just that it wasn't, it wasn't my thing for me. I did go to church because my family was Catholic and to little like children's schools when I was younger. But mostly in my life, um, really not religious. I've been like alone my whole life. Never really felt peace, never really felt love. I was basically an atheist. And that's what really kept me from trying to learn from trying to learn from God and from Jesus. So it was, I, I go to the jungle. It's called the jungle. Uh, it's for like co college students and like young adults. Every Tuesday at a inclusion cafe downtown. And there was this guy. He, he was giving like a speech. He said something about the universe that I just realized that that there must be something that's intellect out there to be able to bring all these things finely tuned for us to be here. Honestly, I was just pursuing knowing about how, I guess just knowing how everything works in life. It was bad because it, it just kept, these emotions just kept eating at me and nagging at me. And, you know, after, you know, fast forward today, I'm, all, I'm more open. I'm able to talk to people. I'm able to just be myself pretty much because I realized how this person named Jesus took all of these beatings, took all of this suffering, this pain, just for me to be here and be able to share this with you guys. I met this person named Shayna through uh, UTA. I went up to her and was like, hey, what is this about? She told me about it. She told me to come to the community group. Not just her, but many others in the group, they told me about him and more and more and more as I kept learning. And so they had really, really had a great influence in me because they kept teaching me about the Bible teaching me about Jesus and God. It's really important to be able to connect with others and try to learn as much as you can. I don't think it's good to be just on your own. I think it's better to have a community group that people are willing to be there for you. Really, I thank her and everybody in the community group for accepting who I was in the beginning, not judging me because I was not I was a non-believer back then. Uh, come come to church, dude. Even if, if, it, if it feels weird, just come. Really, and try to connect yourself with the community group like I did. Ask questions about people who are, who are believers and we can get a perspective from them. Just keep asking questions and questions like I did. You might in the future say yes to Jesus 